okay so hello friends today our topic is the demographic cycle so what is demographic cycle so demographic cycle is a theory that focuses on changes in birth rate and death rate okay now there are two index are there that is the CVR that is the crude birth rate okay crude birth rate it is the total number of births divided by total mid year population into thousand and another one is the CDR that is the crude death rate that is the total number of deaths divided by total mid year population okay now let's understand the cycle <coughs> so there are different phase in the demographic cycle phase one also called the high stationary phase phase two is the early <coughs> expanding phase phase three is the late expanding phase late expanding phase phase four is low stationary <coughs> sorry low stationary and five is the declining now let's draw the graph first then we will understand in CBR and CDR so first draw the CBR that is the crude birth rate so this will be like up to this then it starts to declining then like this and this next is CDR so CDR will be like this then this and then this and then this so now let's understand in the phase so first is CVR in high stationary phase so we will see first CVR so CVR in high stationary phase so this is the phase one that is high the answer will be high stationary phase it is high CDR is also high okay because we measure level from the bottom so both are high okay now early expanding phase so early expanding is phase 2 so this is remains high but it starts to decline it starts to decrease okay it is high but it starts to decrease <coughs> starts okay starts next is late expanding that is the phase 3 here it is phase 3 so now this also starts that is the C it is the CBR this is the CDR so CBR also starts to decrease and it is already decreasing so both are now <coughs> decreasing decreasing okay next low stationary phase so that is the phase 4 so here this became low and this also became low so answer will be low now declining phase declining phase here this is the one answer that is the CDR is now became greater than CBR now another concept is the demographic gap okay so demographic gap demographic gap let's understand this so in this demographic gap the formula is d uh, g is equal to 
CBR minus CDR. This is called the growth rate. Okay. This is the growth rate and this is called the <coughs> demographic gap. Okay. So now let's understand in the graph. So here you can see, let's take this is the this is the demographic gap between CTBR and CTR. Okay, so here it is. The this is the demographic graphic gap. Now let's solve four question about demographic gap. So first one is the question. First one is the maximum so why the demographic gap gets maximum let's see in the graph that is the here it is you can see this point and this point is called late phase 2 so answer will be late stage 2 okay okay so now next question is the starts contraction okay so now let's see in the graph so here you can see it is start contracting from the early phase 3 so the answer will be early stage 3 okay next is the minimum <laughs> where the demographic gap is minimum so it will be in one and four looks these are the more larger gap is more larger than these two so answer will be one and four next question is the negative so why then it become negative so here you can see this phase for stage five okay the answer is stage 5 so that's it the demographic cycle the whole concept so guys if you like this video then please do not forget to hit the like button and please do subscribe my channel